Good morning, DLV. How's everybody doing? What's kicking chickens? It is a summer day in FLA. Just look at the color of that sky. But that's no reason not to clean your pool and get ready for a possible swim later on tonight. You're doing good. You're doing fantastic. Keep your pool clean, kids. <laughs> that's a pro tip from Sean Duncan. Watch, here's one more. You want one more? Uh, <laughs> keep your pool clean, kids. Ha <laughs> ha, twofer. Well, life can hit you pretty fast sometimes. I just went on a little day trip and uh, I blew out my tire on a pothole that I didn't realize how deep it was because of all the rain. Life is fun sometimes, right? Right. Yeah, right. you stay with a forced smile. Now I got some little baby tire on my car right now. It looks kind of, it's kind of embarrassing. Look at this. Oh, look at the little tire. Can't go above 50 miles per hour or 80 kilometers per hour for all you normal metric people. Look at that thing. Uh. Of course. You just gotta smile. So to reiterate, what did we learn from this? Uh, if you see a pothole in the rain, just assume it's 9,000 feet deep <laughs> and either go incredibly slow or go around it. And uh, when life happens, when life gives you lemons, just just try and smile. Let me get your best smiling face. Forced smile. That's a good smile. <laughs> Is that a forced one? Yes. Forced smile? <laughs> That's a good one. We're gonna counteract this and we're gonna have some fun. We're gonna go do one of those little bring your own wine and paint kind of things where there's like an instructor at the front and they teach you stroke by stroke how to make a beautiful masterpiece. It's probably gonna look like a Picasso painting. Unintentionally. <laughs> All right, we're here. We got our paint colors, our blank canvas. Yeah. What's your name, partner? Julie. Julie. Yeah. Julie and I, we made a thousand dollar bet. Whoever's painting is better. The other one owes the other person a thousand dollars. Okay, you got it. No, wait, no. She sounds too confident. It's your first time. Sorry. Uh, uh, that is an old. <laughs> it's the wine talking. Yeah, there you go. I, the grape juice. Cheers. Technically. Cheers. 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 Salud. <laughs> I almost lost a thousand dollars. There's my start. Looking pretty solid. Sean, he's got a. He's getting some wavy waves. I like that. Ma, how are we doing? Yeah, I got it. I'll take a look. Oh, yours actually really good. Thank you. Nice. I like that, Ma. I think yours is the best one so far, Ma. This is pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. No, I'm not. That looks good. I like that. Yeah, but your the texture of your sand and everything is really nice. Competition still on though. <laughs> the rest of the white. So you want to make these lines a little bit thicker. All right, update. I think it's looking pretty good. Nice. What you got over your mouth? Yeah, I still think yours is the best so far. That's add awesome. Some That's a good one. Right between the white. The shadow there. Sean, quit your lines. Do your lines. Hey, every artist works their own pace. My pace is very slow. <laughs> it's coming along. Look at that. What was your name again? Oh, Tiffany. Tiffany. Oh, video? Yeah, oh, it's wonderful. video. Yeah. Oh, great. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's weird. Tiffany said that mine was the best painting she's ever seen come across this class uh, or any class thereafter. That was really sweet of you. Thank yeah, you so right. much. My yeah. words exactly. <laughs> what? I I would have make that up. There it is. My beach house. Funny thing is, I don't know if you guys noticed this. She wanted us to draw this flag, which I'm not sure is that's Puerto Rico. Is that Puerto Rico? I instead opted to paint this Florida flag. I'm a bit biased, big fan of Florida. Sean did a way better one than I did. Thank you. Dude, your painting looks awesome. It is pretty good. I don't know, I like mine. I'm a big fan of the amateur, looks like a third grader painted it. Ma, how's yours looking? Oh, you're just fun. I like that. Nice. Oh, she did a shark fin? <laughs> By the way, if we would have stayed betting, you would have won 100% because of the shark fin. <laughs> you would have won because of the shark fin if we kept that bet on. <laughs> that was all of our first paintings, right? Yes. Nice. That's, that's something you're going to hang out forever. Your very first painting? Oh my gosh, it is so humid out here. <laughs> the, the glass is fogging up so much right now, I can't see anything. There they are. These are the three paintings side by side. It's the same painting that we all based uh, what we were trying to do off of, but you kind of get three different pictures. It's 
nuts. <laughs> My mom went with this small house. That's all right. I think it makes it more authentic. Look at this, just like the palm trees, all completely different styles of palm trees. Almost any town has one of these. It's just kind of like a, you show up and they teach you how to paint. You can like bring your own bottle of wine if you're old enough. And uh, you just kind of, you have a good time. And I, I don't know, that's my first painting ever. I'm gonna hang that up in every house that I have. Another crazy thing we noticed is like, each house is different, you know, all the flower beds are in different spots, but all three of us made the horizon, like the water line, on the exact same level. And the skies almost look like they're put together. Try and just focus on the sky and the water. Isn't that crazy? It's almost like we're related or something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, DLV, well I think I'm gonna hit the sack. Where did that come from? Where does the saying hit the sack come from? Because I can't even think of what, <laughs> hitting a sack, like a sack of potatoes. Someone, someone help us out. Someone explain where it came from. Anyway, I'm gonna head to bed. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate that. Um, only a couple more days till Japan, which is gonna be awesome. But uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow for another sweet vlog. Bye. These things more and more. Uh, they carry the water bottle. Oh my gosh, I think this one's broken. This time it's up to 34,474. Sweet. I can already tell that this is going to be a short vlog. Because I'm spending all day on the plane. Flying out to LA, it's fun because you gain that three hours going out there. Coming back, it's a six hour flight to Atlanta, and you lose three hours. And I can't really film on a plane, it's just so damn noisy.